Lech Lecha is this coming parasha. It is the story of Abraham Avinu leaving from Ur of Chaldea. In this story, I would like to hone in on one particular topic, and that is faith. We are told that Abraham Avinu left a place not known to his forefathers and sojourned to a place that the Most High promised for him and his future generations. In the story of Lech Lecha, which means go for yourself or go to yourself, it's a very interesting concept for the title of such a parasha. Because many times we don't know who we are until we leave the environment that we're familiar with. Sometimes we're so engulfed with our environment, we forget who we are. In this case, Avraham Avinu discovered something very, very important about himself. And in doing that, he also discovered something important about why he exists. Avraham Avinu, when he was in Ur of Chaldea, his father was an idol maker. And we're told in the Midrash that his father came home one day and saw all of the idols smash into little bits and pieces. When Terah went to Abraham, his son, and asked him, why did you destroy this? Abraham answered and replied, I didn't do these things. Pointing at an idol that was the biggest of them all, holding an ax in his hand and said, he did it. His father looks at Abraham and says, no way. He couldn't have done that. And Abraham says, yes, he did. So his father says, he's only a statue. How could he have done all these things? And Abraham says, exactly. These are only statues. From there, he searched. He looked in the stars. He looked at the moon. He looked at the sun. And he realized none of those things were worthy to be worshipped. And the reason why he looked at those things is because other peoples who left the stones and the wood pieces alone started to worship those things. But it was not until he began to go for himself, look for himself, that he understood. And two things happened. The Most High revealed himself to him, and he discovered the Most High. Faith is the most practical way of discovering who we are. In this parashat, read in Bereshit, on this particular Shabbat, the lesson of Emunah, the lesson of faith, something we take for granted, something that we don't often use. We're always worried about doing miswot, doing commandments, but little about faith. So when the practical things in our lives begin to fall apart and we do these different misfold, sometimes we forget the misfold is for ourselves to get closer to the Creator. And whenever that happens, we have the providence of the Most High. He provides for us. Let us remember, in those times, things seem dire. Things seem that they're going all kinds of ways that you do not anticipate them to go, but they seem like to go for the worst. Believe in the Most High. Have faith. Have faith that in everything that you do, in your miswa, that the Creator will do what He said that He will do for you. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat shalom.